Hey everybody, I know it's been a while and I apologize for that. I've been trying to learn a new painting technique called uh, One Stroke Art. And um, it's actually really fun and I'm, I'm getting there. I'm not nearly as good as the people that I see doing it, but that's okay. Because I still have this and I really, really like this technique as well. So Anyway, what we're going to try to do tonight is... Um, these are two of the 9 by 12 canvas, uh, yeah, canvases, and I'm going to try to do another chain pull, and yes, I'm using white paint, I just, I, I like black and white paints better, I guess, but um, I'm going to attempt to start a flower up here, and then have it come all the way through, basically like one big long flower. But in certain spots, we'll have some uh, some other petals, you know, and go from there. So let's see how this goes. Hopefully this works out, because if not, then there goes two, uh, two canvases that I'll have to reuse. <clears throat> Again, I apologize, everybody, for not being here um, as often as I'd like. One second. But I hope everybody has, you know, had a good time. Some of the people that I, on my last chain pull, some people were saying that they would like to learn it and, you know, that they were going to try it. I hope they have, and I hope they got the results that they wanted. Uh, I seen my boy Wiggles, he did one, and I liked his. His came out pretty good too, so hopefully he does some more. I'm still waiting for that picture with a uh, with the plunger wiggles. Let's do that. <laughs> All right. So. so I'm just gonna try to pull this thing all the way down. So, I see some of the black paint is coming back, so I think what I'm going to do is, instead of dragging it all the way through, I'll start doing this one whenever I get to that one. I gotta figure out how to get rid of that. Yeah, so like I was saying, that one stroke art, it is it is a lot of fun, and you watch the people do it, and it's like, wow, it looks really cool, it looks like a lot of fun to do, the most deceiving part, it looks very simple, and yeah, it's not exactly as simple as I thought it was going to be, but hey, that's fine, I didn't expect to go into it and become an, uh, a one stroke artist master right off the bat. But, you know, we'll see. We'll see how I do with that. Hopefully I get better at it.
I am using a different chain because from the last time that I did my chain pull, I left my chain in the water and I came back up and I noticed that the water was evaporated and the chain was all tangled up on the bottom of it. So I just figured I'll use the other chain that I had. So I hope everybody's having a good night. Hope everything is going the way you want it to go. Um, I'd say I'm having a pretty good night. I was downstairs and I've been wanting to come up here and do a picture for the longest. You know, for a couple weeks now. And That sounds bad. <laughs> I've been wanting to do a picture for a while. But like I said, I've been doing the other thing. And then as I'm downstairs just now, like, I bought these canvases the other day and I was going to come upstairs and just do one picture. But I'm thinking, these are 9 by 12 sizes. If I do one picture, there you go, it's done. I don't want to do that. So I'm like, you know what? Let's put two canvases together and see what that does. See how I do with, with that. So I guess at the end of this, we'll see how I did. By the way, Wiggle, if Wiggles is watching, you know, he's a, he's another YouTube artist who is very, very good with what he does. And, man, his uh, last few pictures have been really, really pretty cool. Like uh, that Punisher one that he did. I really like that one. That was, that was pretty sweet. I, I've had that idea to do something like that. I just never acted on it because I never knew who I wanted to do. I like Punisher. I like everything that deals with skulls pretty much, but never, never had that idea to do exactly what he did. And yeah, I kind of wish that I did because it came out awesome. I really like how it came out. And if you guys haven't seen it, you should go watch that video. It came out really awesome. See, it's different. Last time I was putting the chain over here, and wrapping it around and this is what you get this time I put the chain close to what if you want to call this a stem I put it close to that and you get that effect that effect looks really nice I think I might go back over this using that effect because this kind of looks like a dirty little petal right here will it work cast your votes now If it doesn't work, then it's a possibility that I just ruined this whole picture. But then again, I don't think I can do it. The reason why is there's this. This goes down past this. But yeah, I don't, I don't know. Might be... I don't want to say stuck, but might be okay with what we have. I want to see something, though. I really don't like that this is here. What can I, what can I put there? I'm gonna wipe that out. And then I have more black paint right here. Perfect. Can't even tell. That's that's a dirty little dirty little secret right there. Where am I going to put the next one? And I know as you guys are watching this, you guys are like, don't put it here, put it there, or don't put it here, don't do that, don't, just leave it alone, stop, leave it alone. Guys, I have to learn how to, to walk away. <laughs> but it's so hard. 
I really do want to fix this. All right, I'm going to try it. No guts, no glory, right? Oh, I did that right in black. <laughs> no guts, no glory, right? But then again, if I try and it don't work, then I feel dumb. But it's all on camera. I don't know if that made it better. I don't know if it made it worse. I mean, it still looks like the inside, like you can see deep down into the flower, right? I mean, it still looks pretty cool to me. And I like how it does a little feathery effect. This one right here, though, I think this is the best looking petal. Heck, if I could, I'd like to redo that one. I'm gonna have to like buy some sponges or something. I'm going through paper towel like, like it's nothing. Make sure I ain't dripping no paint or anything on my shoes. <laughs> really don't like that. I made it dirtier, <laughs> but I'm good with it. I'm going to leave it alone because it's got these little bends in it. makes it look really cool like the wind is blowing through it. Okay, that's good enough for me. Plus, I don't want to take a chance on messing anything up. But like right now, it looks really, really good. You know what's funny though? If I add like a little thing right here, just a um, like this. I could rotate this out. I can make this the top one and this the bottom one or keep it as it is. You know what I'm saying? I mean, I like it how it is. It looks really cool. But that would be a really, really cool little thing to do. Just put a little... Hmm. But if I do that... You know what? I'll just leave it alone. I think I'll just leave it like that. I could either leave it like this, or whenever I hang it up, I could put this as one over there, put this as one over there. I could switch it around. But I like it like this. I think this is cool. So let me do something real quick. I told Wiggles I would do this next time. Forgive me for one second. I have to take my camera down. Do a close up. Wiggles was talking about this last time. That I should do this. I apologize for that light beam right there. Really, nothing I can do about it. So there's that. There goes that one. There is some little air bubbles. I'm going to go ahead and run a, um, a torch through just to pop them. But yeah, if you ever look at a flower closely, I mean, when you look at it from a distance, they all look perfect. They all look really nice and pretty and all that. But if you ever look at one closely, you'll see the tiny little imperfections. I think that's what I'm going to call those. Those little bitty areas right there. Those are the flower's imperfections. 
All right, everybody, that's what I got for you. I hope you like it. This was a whole lot of fun. There you go. There's what the finished product will look like. Minus that white spot right there. <laughs> all right, guys. Have a good night. Love you all.